Here is the last of your down payment, Doctor. The rest comes when I get what I need. And if I don't, Kulyadkin makes the final payment. There's no need for melodrama. The mutagen was compounded to your specifications. One more jolt. And you're a new man. I feel nothing. Days of treatments and still nothing. You dare try to fool Kravinov! Admit it! You are in league with Spider-Man. His scent is all over this lab. You can smell him? I'm owed an apology, Kravinov. Call me Craven. Craven, the hunter. It's not like I want bad things to happen to Flash. It, well, not super bad things. Uh, well, at least not super bad things that make Liz forget I exist. But why stress over Liz anyway? I'm into Gwen. You right? I know that getup. Kravinov, is that you? You can call me Craven now. I could call you a lot of things. What happened to you? Same as happened to you. Except Craven pay for higher class of DNA. You paid to do that to yourself? Of course. Now Craven climb and leap like leopard, run fast as cheetah, and possess strength of lion. Don't get any ideas. Before, your powers gave advantage. But Craven has leveled the field, and you will fall like any prey! I hate to break it to you, Tabby, but you're not my first genetic experiment gone wrong. Just the first that smells like a litter box. All I smell is fear. Perfect. Hang on, gotta take this. Please? Oh, Kitty, thank goodness. Flash is in surgery and I'm freaking out. Can you come to Manhattan General? Uh, I'm kinda in the middle of something. Please, Petey. I really need you. You do? Oh, okay. As soon as I can, I, I promise. Thanks, Petey. Oh, Flash's parents are here. Gotta go, bye. Yeah, she's gotta go. That's it. I've had enough of gorillas for one night. This one's for Flash. I can't believe I just thought that. Kitty kitty. I wish I was playing hide and seek with Black Cat. I so prefer my feelings female. Yeah, the werewolf look was passe, but the mummy thing, pure gold.
prey. Ah, uh, sorry, who's the prey? Take that, pussycat. A lesson in humility, courtesy of the original and still number one genetic misfit, me.